Hello everyone and welcome back to another video on my channel. Today we are going to be doing something quite different again. It's not going to be an unboxing video. It's not going to be a Rolex video. It's going to be a show and tell type of video, I guess. I've been wanting to do this video for quite a while now because I've been seeing other YouTubers do it and I have a collection of myself, which is manga right here. I don't know if you can see it, but, but that's not all. I have manga right here too and my attack on titan sets up there and i also have more below my desk which i shall show you after but disclaimer i have not read all of my manga but i've read most of my manga but yeah i just wanted to say that to you guys before you we go on to the collection tour i guess so without further ado let's just get started okay so this is my um there's some books here too but this is the shelf i have recently got actually so thank you to my mom who got me this shelf but this is perfect for my manga now because i share a room with my sister and i get like one side of the room and she gets the other so this is perfect and fits right in this like corner but here is all my mangas there's some on the back and i might have to turn it around after but if we go over here i have the first four volumes of maid sama i don't know if you would consider this as the omnibus because they're they're like the same size of a normal size manga but they contain two volumes in it and they're quite thick but yeah i have volumes one two three and four here are my singular manga uh, volumes. I have uh, read and some I haven't read, like Cheeky Brat I've already read, The Fiance Choose by the Ring, Chosen, Choose, Chosen, or on High School Host Club I have read, Yakuza Lover I haven't finished. <laughs> if you know why, you know why. Um, Sakura Haimi Hi Haim I have not read, I have read, and I have not read. Moving on, I have my... Pretty Guardian Sailor Moon volumes, but I am missing volume two, though I have volume two of the larger <laughs> type, which is kind of suck. I wish I had the volume two of this type uh, of like part of this because I have volume one, three, four, and five. So it's like not the complete set, but I'm getting there. I've had these for quite a while actually. So this isn't a potential manga like manga set i am collecting right now probably in the future i will make it as a goal because i love sailor moon so yeah but this is the sailor moon crystal oh whoa i can't even lift it up the next uh manga set i have is kiss him not me and i love this anime so much oh my god i remember watching this over and over in grade seven like this anime got me hooked but yeah i have volumes one one two seven 13 and 14 so i've watched the anime and i really want to continue this like this is a goal that i plan oh my head whoa my headphones just fell this is a manga goal that i want to pursue like soon because i want to actually continue reading this i love the anime i know who she gets with i'm not gonna spoil it but yeah, uh, but I haven't read these volumes because obviously I don't have the other volumes, so I don't want to spoil myself. But I have read volumes one, two, three, and four. I don't have uh, three and four, but I read it at school, but I have volumes one, two. Then if we go here on the second shelf, I have some manga up here. I have We Never Learn. I haven't actually read this one yet. I've actually seen little clips of the anime. But I haven't actually read the manga. I just I just have it. This is actually from a friend. <laughs> then I have oh my god. Promise Neverland is like one of my favorite animes ever. This is the art book. Like I've always wanted this and I remember seeing it for the first time and I'm like, I dropped I didn't drop all my books, but this book I was definitely most getting out of like the rest of the items that I had in my hand. I remember getting it. But it's just so Oh my god, the anime is so good. I've read the whole manga series, and I'm so sad about- I'm so disappointed of season two, like honestly. But I've read the manga, and I love the, the manga. <laughs> the next uh, book I have is the official anime guide for Jujutsu Kaisen. It's just some of the characters and like the little snippets of the episodes and stuff. That's really cool. 
I think it even has a poster in it. Yeah, it does. But I'm not gonna... I'm not gonna ruin this book. But moving on to this shelf. This is my... Uh, I collect mangas. I pr I prefer romance mangas. That's just like my go-to. But here I have Kamisama Kiss. I think this is the... This is just the little... Uh, I think this is... I don't know what this is. Actually, this is the only Kamisama Kiss uh, volume I have because I got this from a friend. So, I don't know if this is a spin-off. You guys can comment down below what this is. But I know that there's art in here and it's really cute. Then here we have me and my brothers. This was actually bought by Jenny and Karma when I went to go visit them. I <laughs> I still remember how it went. But guys, if you're watching this, thank you for buying me this. I'm I haven't came to read this, but like thank you. I'm I'm grateful for it. But it's called Me and My Brothers, and I haven't uh, read it yet. You could read the back there. I do actually plan on reading this soon. I have volumes 1 through 11, which I think 11 is actually the final volume. The next manga I have is Strobe Edge, but it's not the complete version. It's like 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 10, which is kind of weird. I, I had this for a while. I had this like since I was a kid. So uh, yeah, they're kind of discolored. They're yellow. Some of them are yellow, so I've had them in the wild or they've just been sitting in the sunlight. Here we have my love story. I don't have the complete series this is also another random randomized uh, manga I what do you mean what am i doing i'm recording is that jojo jojo i don't collect jojo it's just telling them i like romance uh, manga <laughs> then we go down to the bottom shelf here i have my attack on titan in color uh oh my god wait i can't even take this out hold on let me take this out this is the best of the like attack on titan manga panels in color version i have the first volume and second volume this is just i don't know this is also another grab that i just couldn't like resist to put down i just had to get it because if you haven't already know if you haven't already know, if you don't already know, Attack on Titan is actually one of my, also one of my favorite, favorite animes. Like, besides, uh, Snow White the Red Hair. Alright, but moving on to the next mangas, I have the Hatsum- Whoa, 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 I cannot see her name. Manga. This is a story and art. I think it's a it's an unofficial book, so yeah. The next uh, manga I have is K on. This is the first volume, and then this is I haven't actually read this one. I think this is just another side volume to K on. Then I have oh my god I I don't want to pronounce this manga or anime because I don't know how to pronounce it but i was actually planning on reading this volume last night i've had these volumes for quite a while and i haven't actually gotten to read them and because i've only watched the anime so i want to read the manga too next one this one i've read in grade uh i think it was grade eight i remember reading this in grade eight and oh my gosh i fell in love i only read this from the pi oh my god the public library but now i actually got my hands on it and this is the volumes one two three and four the next set of manga is I have Bite Maker, uh, volumes 1, 2, and 3. Uh, this is um, very uh, explicit, if you know what I mean. Twilight! What's Twilight doing here? What are you doing here, Twilight? <laughs> the next manga series I have is High School of the Dead. I've watched the anime, and I love zombie uh, movies, animes, anything to do with zombies, I love it, sign me up. Uh, but I have the whole set right here of volumes 1 through 7. And now, going to the back side, I had to flip it, but we go back to the top. Here is a manga that I actually have not read. I've seen, uh, little clips of the anime. Love and Focus, I've read a long time ago, and I really loved it. But yeah, I have Tokyo Meow Meow, uh, here. Oh my god, I have this, uh, manga, Ga- Gakuin? I think that's how you pronounce it. I don't know. Please forgive me if I haven't pronounced it right. But I have that. I have Angels of the Death. Angels of, of the Death. Angels of Death. I love this anime so much. So, so much. The anime and I want to collect the manga one day. So this is a potential collection that I want also. I have Hellgirl. 
I have a vampire dormitory, dorm, oh my god, dorm, dormitory, oh my god. I have the first volumes, uh, one and two. I actually collected this before the anime ca came out. I know that there's an anime now. Oh my god, I have Hotomiya, but I have only volumes one and 14. I have those not so sweet boys. <laughs> I remember I read this one. I have Our Ride, Daytime Shooting Star. I have In the Name of the Mermaid Princess. I want to pronounce it wrong because I like when I pronounce something wrong, I feel bad. But this is also another romance anime. It's volumes one and two. I have Boarding School, Juliet, volumes one, two, and three. Going down to the second one. This is where the Promise Neverland collection. This was actually one of my first collections that I've collected meow, 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 by myself. Yep. But fun fact, this is one of the manga collections that I've actually collected by myself. With Whoa, wait, I just realized I could like z zoom out. It should. Oh, <gasps> there's a kitty. Oh my god. Hello. But uh, this is a manga set that I have uh, collected by myself and I'm so proud of it. I remember this is one of my first collections, actually. But yeah, I have the Promised Neverland manga. Here we have Spy X Family. I have the first volume, and then I also have the Japanese uh, version of like the info of the characters and the anime and stuff. Down to the bottom shelf, I have Jujutsu Kaisen's from volume zero through nine. This one can't go there, so it has to be misplaced, and it's kind of bugging me. But here I have the full collection of A Silent Voice. This anime is so... I love it. And she has, I have Shoko's little book, notebook. It's just right there. Wait, I can't really take it out, but it's right there. And here we have Dreaming Sun. This was one of the first romance mangas that I actually, <gasps> what's going on with my book? Oh my God, wait, I gotta fix that. This was one of the first romance uh, collect or books that I actually tried to collect. Uh, I didn't end up actually collecting or finishing it. But this was like one <laughs> I remember as a like few years ago back then I tried to collect it. I have volumes one, two, three. I think this is yeah, four, and then I have ten. So I've read volumes one through four. I haven't read ten because obviously I haven't gotten to ten, so I'm not gonna read it. But yeah, that is my uh cart of manga in the corner here that fits just perfectly. But yeah, that is my manga here. The next uh, mangas that I want to show you is my favorite shelf. So my favorite mangas go on my shelves above my monitor. So I have here, oh my god, I remember buying these. I remember, do you guys remember like back then on TikTok, like in 2020, there was like these few TikTokers who like read these. I don't know. I'm not going to pronounce how they are pronounced because I can't pronounce them right. They're like the haiku uh, stories with like the characters that you could interact like you're their partner or friend or something and then they're like talking to you. I don't read Japanese though, but I, you know what I can do is read pictures. So that has to work, right? I mean, like I have the captain's volume and then I have Kuru and Oikawa. So yeah. Then I also have Kyo acrylic stands that are in front of my Fruits Basket manga. I have volumes uh, 5, 6, and 7 of the smaller ones. I have the Fruits Basket uh, complete anime like art kind of book style. Art book. This is my bigger versions of, or the larger versions of the manga. I have volumes 1, 2, 3, 3, I was going to say 4, I don't have 4, 5, 6, and 12. This is also a collection that I am currently in collect or currently collecting like if i see the volume i will get it but um yeah and here is my most prized possession my most one of my most favorites but uh, it, no it is my favorite my favorite manga collection i have so far is snow white with the red hair i have volumes 1 through 26 except for volume 10 i am actually going to buy volume 10 here i have the snow White with the red hair uh fan book this i actually just got this recently and i do plan on getting the other fan i don't think it was the fan books the art books the mini ones so i do plan on getting that on ebay but here's the characters. Where's Obi? Wait, guys, we gotta find Obi. I found him! Oh! 
<gasps> oh my god, Obi's my favorite character. Oh my god. I love him so much. Look how good. Oh, when he's in his night suit. Oh my god, I'm fangirling right now. <laughs> it's so good. Oh my gosh. But if you go up here, this is my... Oh, there's some Maracas Ladybug. <laughs> collectibles right there and Pikachu but this is my attack on Titan collection as you can see it is not the complete collection I am missing like four more volumes but this this is what I have I have a you can I have a lot of Aaron <laughs> of Aaron uh figures and stuff so I don't think I'm gonna be able to pull out the mangas but uh there is the mangas there there's a duplicate of three so um yeah then these are the omnibuses, which is a lot larger than the Maid Sama like manga. So this would be considered as an omnibus. I just don't know if the Maid Sama would be considered as one. Here I have the Talented Adventure books, where it's a, no a light novel, and you are a character inside, and you get to choose the paths you want to, which the story would give you, and it would give you an answer of the path you chose. Here I have the Attack on Titans No Regrets Volume 1 and 2. I got the character Eclopedia. And then I got the spoof on Titan. So I do want to get the Attack on Titan, uh, oh my god, what are they called? Lost Girls volumes. And if I could get my hands on the No Regrets, uh, like the bigger book, the hardcover book, I would love that. And the rest of the other Attack on Titan manga that I could get my hands on. Yeah. Those mangas that you see on my shelves are the most, like, prize-possessed to me, prize-possession to me. Like, I, I love them so much that they have to be on my shelf. So here I got Hello World, the manga, I have Demon Slayer, I have Chibi Vampire, this is a BL manga that I haven't read. These are most of the mangas that I have not read or that I don't really plan on reading or continuing. Oh my god, Amaru-chan, this was like one of the first mangas that I've actually collected. Oh my god, I hear the Sunspot BL, uh, this is, I like this one too. Uh, but I'm not, sadly I'm gonna not collect it. I lost interest in this a long time ago because I've had this book for a long time. I have the Death Note uh, Volume 3, this is how to read, so this is like about the characters and the anime and stuff. Happy kind of goes Killer Life, this is also a very cute and funny manga, but I don't think I'll be planning on collecting this. New Game, this... <laughs> This for Maru-chan was one of my first ever mangas. I can't remember which one, but one of the two. I have Toradora, volume one. This is the light novel. The rest of them is just uh, Haikyuu volumes. I don't plan on collecting right now. I don't know if this would be a collection that I'd actually be collecting. Maybe in the future, I, but I just don't really see myself finishing it. But this is most of the volumes that I've already have. It goes down all the way to the bottom. I can't really move it. But yeah, it's just a bunch, like 1, 2, 3, 10, 21, like, you know, just all that random ones. Here I have Love is War Volume 2. I have uh, this one. This is also another BL, uh, My Hair Academia uh, Ultra Analysis. This is like about the characters and stuff. This is a very cute manga. It's actually in color. It's called Bounce Back. Uh, here we have My Hair Academia Volume 7. The other My Hair Academia volumes are actually back there kind of falling but they're back there i have uh tokyo ghoul volumes one two and three this is my uh l change the world uh light novel and here i have um, all of my anime magazines from the shoujo beat uh, dot com and it's volumes uh volumes why am i saying volumes these aren't volumes the year 2007 2008 2009 and all that stuff they're upside down, but yeah, these this is like something that I'm never gonna get rid of. I actually got this from a gift. I, I got it as a gift, or someone gave it to me, so I'm very grateful for that. And then last but not least, I have Miraculous Ladybug Volumes 1 and 2. I know that Volume 3 is out. I think Volume 4 is in the making, or it's you could get it pre-ordered now, but I have Volumes 1 and 2. The best of the best. I will love Rex Ladybug until the day I die. Oh my god. It's just, it's so cute. Oh, I forgot to mention, when I was showing my story with the red hair, volume 17 was missing was because I'm actually reading it right now. I think I've already said the beginning of the book, but it's actually on my shelf by my bed. But, um, yeah.
But anyways, guys, that is it for today's video. Thank you all so much for watching. I hope you enjoy. A lot of me talking and showing you my manga, I just wanted to show you guys because I've seen other YouTubers do it and I never thought I wanted to do it. I really wanted to show you guys my manga that I've been collecting over the past few years since I was just a little one. <laughs> but anyways guys, thank you all so much for watching. Make sure to hit that like button and subscribe if you want to see more videos just like this or if you guys have any other gameplays or under other unboxing videos you that you guys want me to do, comment down below and I shall seek to it. Anyways guys, thank Thank you all so much for watching. I hope you all have a wonderful day. Bye.